Hi, Ron Mayer with HowsYourBack.com, and I want to talk to you today about taking painkillers. I met a friend the other day who said he's been suffering from back pain for a few months, and I asked him, is he giving himself any relief? Is he taking any painkillers? He said, no, I don't want to get addicted to it. I don't want to hurt my liver, but it's important. It's important to take painkillers for a couple of reasons. One is you need to give your mind some rest. You need to relax, you need a little vacation from your pain. Pain is very agitating. Besides being annoying, pain can be very tiring. The second point is that you need to give your body some rest. You need to take a break. By taking pain medication, you're giving your nervous system a chance to recuperate. By having constant pain, permanent pain all the time, the pathways of the nervous system can establish a permanent pathway and you want to break it up. You want to make sure that you give your body some rest, your mind some rest, take some medication so you don't feel any pain so your body can act naturally. Which brings me to the third reason is that in a study that was done, people with pain tend to use their core strength and core muscles less than they use their extremities around the house or any activity they do. So what happens is when you want to reach for something, instead of using your core muscles and reaching for something, people with back pain use more their legs and their arms and thereby weakening even further their core muscles which you need to strengthen. So taking pain medication will allow you to use your body naturally and use your core system and core muscles and thereby strengthening it which is what you need to do in order to get rid completely of back pain. And we'll talk about that in another video of how to and what you should do to strengthen your core.